Tout le monde est bien dansé, ça. Ah, voilà, mais c'est très bien. Alors, rédigez le public quand vous pouvez pour faire un petit tour. Allez, il y a une dans la deuxième finale. Je vais demander à Rémi et à Rémi de nous retrouver dans la sortie du tunnel. Est-ce que vous êtes prêts pour la deuxième finale Alors, le public, est-ce que vous êtes prêts pour la deuxième finale Ah, double liste. Deuxième finale, double liste. Allez, Rémi et Rémi. Rémi est sportif. Rémi aussi. Deuxième finale double mixte, j'appelle la paire danoise, composée de Mathias Christiansen et Léna Rebac. On a connu bien avant, s'il vous plaît, 21 ans et 23 ans, de droitier, tous les deux, 65 e au rang mondial. C'est leur deuxième participation et attention, ce sont les tenants du titre. Face à la paire danoise, les Pays-Bas, avec Samantha Dardy et Romain Tabelli. 26 ans et 21 ans, droitier également 149 e au rang mondial, première participation et demi-finaliste à l'Irish Open.
Ready to play, please. Ladies and gentlemen, on my right, Samantha Burning and Robin Tuberlin, the Netherlands. <laughs> and on my left, Matthias Christiansen and Lena Grebach, Denmark. <laughs> Samantha Burning to serve to Lena Grebach. Lovell, play. Service over, one love. Two love. Service over. One, two. And you're welcome back. We're into the mixed doubles final here. The Orle Orleans International defending champions in black. Representing Denmark, Lena Greback Four. and Matthias Christiansen. Service over. And in blue for the Netherlands, Three. it's Robin Tabelin and uh, Samantha Barning. Defending champions, fourth seeds here for the tournament this year, and a buy in the opening round. And then a sluggish start, taking down French qualifiers Corbet and Tran in the second round in three games, and started to find Four, their rhythm. One, beating uh, another French pair, Bastien Casaudi and Leah Palermo, in the following round in two, and had that really good two-game win in the semi-final yesterday. 13 and 13 over 10 in July of Malaysia. The runners up from uh, Poland Two, last week. Four. And Robin and Samantha. Well, they set their stall out very early, beating the number two seeds from Canada in the early Three, rounds. And four. then uh, beating Ben Lane and Jessica Pugh of England. Pugh and Lane. One of the rising pairs coming out of England in mixed doubles. Great tradition, of course, in mixed doubles in England. Semi and then in yesterday's semi-final, beat Marvin three. Seidel and Linda Elf Effler of Germany again in three games, 21-18 in the deciding set. <laughs> On paper, the defending champions, certainly the favourites. Four, five. But uh, it hasn't been a very successful recent weeks. Beaten the first round of German Open and Swiss Open. Won the Austri Austrian Open back in the beginning of March. And runners up at the Swedish Masters. The winners of the Irish Open at the end uh, of 2015, beginning of December. Six, and of course, uh, defending champions here, the Orléans International. The last 
remaining defending champions still left in the tournament. Service over. Five, six. Over. Seven, five. Eight, five. Nervy start from all four players on court. First two points. That is over. For the Danes really set Six the tone eight. and they've kept their noses in front. So we solve nine six. Good return from the Dutch and Samantha Savisova, on the seven, third shot of the rally, nine. putting it away. <laughs> Broken string for Matthias. We saw the ten seven. Yeah. And uh, Lena Greyback will just take the opportunity, change the shuttle. Just changing the new shuttle again. Ten seven. <laughs> Excellent return. Savi Solva. Robin, he's certainly grown into this tournament. Eight ten. New wish partnership, of course, the Dutch since the retirement of Yorick. Samantha's a uh, long standing partner. And they've started to gel as a pair. To be fair, so over 11 8. But it's the days to get to the interval first, 11 8. As they hunt the defense of their title from last year. Twenty seconds, twenty seconds. These pairs played twice before, and it's the Danes who have the better head to head record. Eleven eight. As recently as the Swedish Masters, where the Danes uh, got the silver medal on that occasion. Beat the Dutch in the quarter final in two games, and uh, when the Irish Open in December, en route to the title. The Danes yet again victorious over Tabling of Barning again in two games. 12 8. Savi Sauber. 9 12. Best result for the Dutch came in that defeat to their opponents uh, in Ireland in Dublin back in December. Other than that, beaten in the first round of the Scottish Open Grand Prix in the Dutch Open. Before that, 
Masters. Again, Sauber. first round defeat. 13 9. In the Swedish Masters in January, the first international challenge tournament of the new year on the Babington Europe circuit. And again, beaten in qualification at the German Open. So uh, this is a real step up in class and a huge improvement for the Dutch in their relatively new pairing. Nine. Savi Sava. 10, 14. Eleven, fourteen. The push down the middle on the return of serve from Christiansen, just drifting over the baseline. Oh, fresh air from Lena Greback. And Rune Massing, the coach of the Dutch, 12, getting very 14. vocal from the coach's chair. Savi Sauver, 15, 12. Savi Sauver, 13, 15. So we saw the 16 13. The power in the smash from Greyback for the winner. <laughs> 17 13. Robin Tabling hunting the net. So we saw the 14 17. And the Dutch just about keeping in touch. I've never got on level terms with the Danes in this game as of yet. The closest they got was at 6 5. Oh. Certainly wild from Robin Tavli. Savi Sauver. 18, 14. Yes. That smash coming flat off the face of the racket, almost hitting the A-boards. The back behind Christiansen and Greyback. Yeah, Robin Tablin just caught a little bit off balance. The clear only half court and easy 14. for the Danes. Oh, and again, fresh air shot from Greyback. And the open court was certainly there for Robin. Game point. 14. But just putting the shuttle out and it takes Greg back and Christiansen to game point in this first game of the mixed doubles final here at the Oleon International. Defending champions, of course, in black for Denmark. Yeah, and it did it. First game. time of asking. And convincingly so. 21 14 in the first game. For Christiansen and Greyback. First game won by Matthias Christensen. Race into a two love lead back and never really look back from there.
now. Second game, love all, play. So after some interval entertainment from the uh, in-house mascots, of course, Plumy, the French Badminton Federation's mascot, hugely popular, the French Open, and yet again here the Orléans International. I'm sure we're going to see Plumy make an appearance at the European Championships Seven coming up in La roche sur yon at the end of next month. One all. The final tournament in what's been a, a, a hectic Olympic qualification year. Still some crucial spots up for grabs and in certainly in the likes of the women's singles where you've got Conan and Schnaza going for the one point. One spot at the Olympics the Europeans and a decent draw at the Europeans could prove vital. Schnaza currently one. leading leading in uh, Olga right behind her in the ranking race for Rio. Other interesting battles of course are the Finnish women's singles Iri Mikola and Nana Vainio vying for that one spot. And in Russia where Sinia Polikarpova has taken the advantage over compatriot after a good uh, performance I think getting to the quarter final down at the New Zealand Open Perminova just falling solid. a little bit, bit behind in that race Three. and of course here in Orléans uh, Pedro Martins by his run to the semi-final in the men's singles has almost guaranteed his place in the Rio Olympics been a great month or two for the Portuguese number one Still spots up for Four grabs. Two. And just as Sabrina Jacquet did four years ago, getting to the quarterfinal in Karlskona in Sweden in the European Championships to deprive Janine uh, Sikogini of a spot for Switzerland. I'm sure there's going to be some uh, interesting battles. And the race is certainly not Five run yet two. for those... Uh, those battles that I mentioned in the last few minutes, interesting times, of course, coming up in this last month. Please, on the court. Thank you. Neither of these pairs, of course, have thoughts of Rio. For Denmark, it's all about Fischer and Pedersen in the mixed. And uh, for the Netherlands, it's all about Selina Peek and Jaco Ahrens who are really battling hard Seven for a spot in mixed doubles. Three, five. Been a few bad tournaments really for Ahrens and Peek on the uh, Super Series circuit. Five or oh. 
And again, you can see the preparation by Greyback at the net. Six. Good five. serve. And then waiting the return, waiting for the return with the racket up. And with the racket up, was able to play that interception, putting huge amount of pressure on the Dutch. And this time, Robin Tavling just finding the corner. Sebi Sova. Six all. This time the flick serve from Robin Tabling straight out of the top drawer. Seven, six. Oh, and Greyback and the awareness of the day and just finding that space in behind the Dutch. Solver. Super shot from Seven Lena. All. Solver. Eight, seven. Oh, what wrist from Christy Anson. Seven, seven. Eight, all. Very, very loose from Samantha Barning. And you can see Lina Griebeck, the anticipation Nine, from the Dane, rushing eight. forward. Easy kill back into the body of Barning for the winner. And the Danes get their noses in front. Oh. Good reactions from Robin. Nine, very four. fast, flat serve from Griebeck. Sava. Then nine. And the pairs trade points on the way to the interval in the second game. Oh, and that's phenomenal from Lena Greebrek. I certainly nine. feel Samantha Barning thought she had the point one with a really tight net shot. But Lena Greebrek quick in her feet, reacting and her reactions taking the net taking the shuttle off the top of the net and pushing it for the winner and it's the Danes with the interval lead 11-9 20 seconds 20 seconds. Eleven, nine. Play. Twenty. 
12, 9. Called in, oh, Matthias Christiansen certainly not happy with that call. Ten, he felt it was out from the time it landed. Savisova. Certainly, 13, that's as easy 10. as it gets for Lena Grebeck in terms of clear winners. Very loose back from the Dutch. It's a daylight now between the Danes and the Dutch. Hot. Good variation Savisova. on the return this time from Robin Tabling. 11 13. Savi Sava, 14, 11. Oh. Yeah, Greeback now really starting to take control of the net. As 15, she did yesterday in the semi final, took on her opponent, forced her opponent to to try and play shots that she shouldn't have really taken on lie the Malaysian really good player Savi Sova 12-15 Savi Sauber, 16, 12. And you can just sense, we can certainly sense that it's almost inevitable. The Danes are heading towards defending their title. Body language certainly uh, an indication, very positive on their feet and on their toes. Greeback and Christiansen and uh, Robin Tabling in particular Hot. just looking a little bit forlorn. But that rally will certainly spur on the Dutch. Savi Sova, 13, 16. Play, please. Savi Sova. 17, 13. Certainly one of the longer rallies in the match so far. Any interception from Greeback putting a lot of pressure on the racket hand of Robin Tabling. You know, and if the Dutch were really going to take this fight to the Danes, you felt that that was a point they needed. A five point lead now for the defending champions, Christiansen and Greeback. 18-13, already won the first, of course, 21-14. 28 minutes gone, and uh, the Danes certainly heading towards a title defence. Unless, of course, the Dutch can pull 18, something out of the fire. 13.
Certainly an unforced error from Samantha. You could tell the frustration as she tossed 13. the racket into the air. And the shuttle just clipping the net court. 20 match point. 30. And with it, takes the Danes to match point. Yeah, Gave. little resistance really from the Dutch and it's the Danes who defend their title. Not as big a celebration as they did when they won the semi-final yesterday. But it's Matthias Christiansen and Lena Greyback with the second year in a row win the Orleans International. Commiserations at the Tabling and Barning. Next match on court is the women's singles. It's Fitzriani of Indonesia against the world junior champion Jin Wei Go of Malaysia. We look forward to that one. And we'll be back in a few minutes with that women's singles final. Matches. Thank you, Matches. 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 Yeah? No problem. Match won by Matches Christensen and Lena Greback, 21 14, 21 13. Thank you. Bravo. Thank you. 
ces applaudissements, c'est une belle finaliste de ce double mix. C'est le deuxième final de cette journée. Allez, la plaque de l'année de la vie. Demi pour les applaudissements. Alors, troisième demi-finale, c'est un simple dame. 